What's going on, guys? I'm Jada Black. Shout out to everyone that's tuning in. I want to talk about huh, this TikToker who posted a video with her mother speaking about how basically the girl's husband shares her with her mother and her sister. So the guy is not only screwing uh, his wife, but he's also screwing his wife's mother and his wife's sister. Talk, talk, talk about keeping in the family. This is where we've gotten to people who are so desperate to have a certain type of guy and they don't really have much going on in their own life that they are sleeping with the same men. Now, this isn't stuff that just goes on uh, in these quote unquote swinger situations. I mean, you got a lot of women who aren't connected to uh, that one particular woman's family or friends. You got women who will share a man who they know is married. They'll share a man that they know have a girlfriend. A lot of these women are sharing men these days because they're so desperate to have a certain type of guy that they're willing to compromise themselves and their value because trust me, you have no value if you're sharing a man. Just so they can be with this one particular guy. And let me tell you something right now. This isn't the first time that she has shared men with her mother. I believe they've shared men a lot. So let's get into this article from the sun.co.uk. Says a my mom and I share, I guess, her husband. People think it's odd, but it brings us closer together. My sister sleeps with him too. So they're having, I, what is it, threesomes and foursomes? And she said it brings them together. A mom and daughter have revealed they both sleep with the same man and they don't see anything wrong with it because they've done this a lot. Maddie Brooks lives with her husband in the United States, but as she explains in her TikTok videos, if she's not in the mood, She's quite happy for her mom to sleep with them. So basically, if she ain't in the mood, <laughs> this guy goes and, and, and screws her mother in the next room. <laughs> now, there are going to be guys that are going to be like, man, I would love to have a situation like that and be in a situation like that. I mean, if that's something that you would do, then, you know, by all means. I mean, we're talking about adults here, right? But you got to understand the nature of women. They're always going to get jealous of each other eventually. And something is going to pop off. But if they're good with their situation, it is what it is. But she can't claim he's cheating after the fact. You know, you're sharing him with your family. Uh, let's see. See this picture of him? That's him. With her mom in that situation. This is because both Maddie, her mom, and her husband are all swingers, meaning they are in open relationships, swapping partners, and swinging parties and events. So they basically live a certain lifestyle where they, where he's basically sharing her with other men too, probably. And he's with other women, including women in her family. Speaking in the video, she says, me and my mom are both swingers, and it's great. You know why? Because when I'm not in the mood, I could just let... My husband, have her. Have your mother. Yeah, I'm that kind of wife. Let my husband have her a couple times a week. But it isn't just her mom that Maddie shares her husband with, admitting that her sister sometimes play uh, with her husband too. She says, you want to know how I keep, I guess, keep him happy? I let him play with my little sister. You know, that's... <laughs> Kind of odd wording, don't you think? <laughs> That's some odd wording there. Play with your little sister. She's using the word play right there, you know? She's not using it any other word. She's using play. Anything for TikTok, right? Her videos have since gone viral, receiving up to 7 million views each, with many left baffled by the family's unusual dynamic. Commenting, one said, That's enough TikTok for a year. I'm out. How did that conversation ever initiate? Ask another wife. Third row, I don't know how anybody could share, but it is, but it's your life. In other relationship news, we, to we told you how millions of Brits are wrecked. Oh, what am I reading? 
yes, people, this is a thing. And you have to understand something. Again, this isn't new to them. She's been, they've been sharing men probably for years. Probably for years. The mom has probably shared her boyfriends with her daughters. I mean, this is what's going on in this family. And the thing is this, man. A lot of these women who have adult daughters who they become friends with, those women, those mothers are attracted to their daughter's boyfriends. In this case, her daughter's husband. Because she ain't got nobody. She wants somebody in her life, but she ain't got nobody. So she look at the stability that her daughter has with the guy that she is with, and she's attracted to that. And that's how these situations go. He probably didn't even initiate. It was probably his wife. Because, again, she talks about how there are times when she's not even in the mood. So he basically goes in the in the master bedroom and he's screwing this chick's mother and her sister, man. It, it's it's I'm telling you, man, anything for TikTok, man. These people will do anything to go viral on TikTok. That's where we're at. We're at a point to where these people get on TikTok and they make these videos and they're pushing a lifestyle. And I want y'all to understand this isn't, this isn't, uh, I mean, this is the minority, but there's a lot of people who do this. I remember being around a girl who I thought was cute and her mother was around and her mother would try to initiate conversation with me because she knew I was attracted to her daughter. And you could just tell when somebody uh, wants your attention, wants you to notice them, Right. And that's what these women do. They try to make that situation to their benefit. And this woman, who is her mother, now again, her mother, you know, you might think that her mother was her older sister. You know, mother may have had her young, right? Didn't really, was able to have fun when she was her daughter's age. Now she's able to do that. The internet has done this to people. It has a lot of these women who are mothers feeling like they could have a, a second uh, thought phase. And to me, if you are willing to share men with your mother and your sister, you don't value yourself. You know, you're willing to do anything that you think is going to keep your husband from cheating. But nothing keeps these men from cheating. <laughs> no matter, no matter if you give them your mother, your sister, or you go to swingers parties, it's not going to change the fact that you know, a lot of these men are still going to do what they want to do at the end of the day. And nothing that you do is going to really change that. They're still going to go out and they're still going to pursue other women because look how confident you've made this guy. You're, you, you literally said he can have your mother and your little sister. So a man in that position isn't just going to be satisfied with that. He's going to want more because he feels like he's in control. What if he gets bored? What if he gets bored of your mother and your sister and you? He's going to want something more. No matter how much you try to control his access to women, he still may want more. He might even leave her for her sister or her mother. We've seen these situations as well. Let us think in the comment section below and uh, let me know your thoughts.